All right, everyone, I wanted to come really quickly and just share a couple of words about the Travis Scott concert. So somebody may be wondering, well, what does the Christian have to say about the Travis Scott concert? I don't know this individual. I don't know the young man. And I don't need to crucify his person or his character. But I will say this, as believers of God and believers in Christ, um, the Bible tells us to stay away from all appearance of evil. So if it looks wrong, if it looks evil, we're supposed to stay away from it. Secondly, the atmosphere was pure evil, according to a lot of the concert goers and the crowd. People felt really uneasy, unsafe, and their person, their physical bodies were harmed. This is what the word declares about that. Let all bitterness and wrath and anger and clamor and evil speaking be put away from you with all malice and be kind one to another, tenderhearted, forgiving one another. There is no way you can tell me in any shape, form, or fashion that anything kind was happening in that concert or within that crowd. Whenever you incite someone to harm someone else, that's not something that I want to be a part of. Neither should it be anything that you want to be a part of. So we have to take in consideration what atmospheres we put ourselves in. Be careful of who you're allowing to lead you because if they're leading you down a path of destruction that's going to harm yourself or others, you definitely should not be involved in it. That's my take on it. I pray peace for those individuals involved and to the families of those who have lost loved ones. I pray that God will give us discernment and insight in where we should be involved and when we should not be involved in certain circumstances and situations. The Holy Spirit will speak loud and clear to you.